what is up you guys welcome back to the vlog today i am discussing some business with a couple of people but check this truck out i am about to leave but when i saw this i just knew i had to put this on video for you guys to see because this classic truck an ls3 very nice interior look at this this design right here is from a Huracan, Lamborghini Huracan. I love the cup holders, just the dash on here. I don't know what it is about the modern clusters that I just adore. That is beautiful right there. I really want to put a cluster like this on my C10. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. This is something I have to do today. Talk to more people about the C10 and uh, continue the day. So like and subscribe, turn the bell notification on, become part of the legacy. una fruta por favor este es el que quiero con todos los tipos de frutas aquí con tantito chile por favor si sí, por favor you gotta get those antioxidants in the body Ooh. guys check this out real quick look at this you see this moving it a blue moving it a green moving it a red moving it a green moving it a blue moving it a red Moving it to what color is this in the middle? This is really badass. All right, I'm about to bounce. See you later, bro. <laughs> So that one right there, that's exactly what I what I want. That's the look that I'm going for. How much does that thing go for? I got the pictures yesterday. Here, I wrote this down. It looks odd to me. It's the last one. Last right one? Now. It's sold. Okay. Yeah. Leave it for a um, Yeah. Yeah, let me... Uh, yeah, it's all that. Okay guys, all right, I finally got, I got a list on what I'm going to be doing for the truck. Trust me, things add up and it gets really expensive, but I really want this truck to look the way I want it. So I'm going to do everything I can to make this possible. So easy when it comes to other trucks besides my truck, because there's just so much creativity that I can play with. And with my truck, it's just so simple. It's just motor. The looks already look good. My truck, I love it. I just don't want to do much to it. Uh, but in the future, I will be doing more things to my truck, my daily. Uh, when it comes to performance, uh, not too much looks, but I want performance and I want that midnight look like that aggressive look. So I'm going to go to exclusive right now. Now, I'm gonna go to exclusive right now and I am going to take out the truck and clean her up it's really hot outside right now but uh, I am going to do it right there where they usually clean their vehicles I don't want to clean it from the outside and the inside so hopefully I don't get sweaty but uh, this is Texas Houston Texas to be exact So guys, guys, so um, I was gonna clean her up, but uh, she won't turn on. Battery's dead. We're gonna take the battery out and we're gonna replace it to see if we can turn it on. And today, hopefully we can clean her by today because it's very hot and I got other things to do. So I'm gonna try my best to get her up and running. So yeah, anything for a C-Ton. I can't wait to change the front grill. Some wheels maybe, the drop. I don't know what else I'm gonna be doing, but I know for sure that this truck is gonna look super clean when I'm done with it. Trust me, I have something in my head. Plus, I just love that it has a 454 motor in this thing. Let's look under the hood, guys. 454 big block Chevy. Chevy big block. 
Gotta love them no matter what. I love the old classic feel on these type of motors. Every time I look at this, I feel like it has NOS. These colors just makes it feel like it's it has NOS, but it doesn't have NOS. I just want to let you guys know this was added. It wasn't. It didn't come originally with this C10, so this was added. These badges were added. I don't want people thinking that it came with it. No, it did not. We are. It does have a 454, so I think it can pull it off just to show people what this truck is capable of on the road when somebody tries to challenge it. I have a lot of plans. <laughs> See if I can buy some new. I mean, this one's kind of good, but this one is like, uh, this is really bad. This one right here, right here is pretty stripped. So I think I'm just gonna buy one, probably buy both. Here's the battery in the back. Gonna get a new one right now. Hopefully, we get her back up and running so I can clean her. Uh, we're gonna, gonna change up the battery. I'll see you soon. Hopefully, we turn you on. I really gotta think of a name for her. I really have to think of a name for her, but uh, for the meantime, it's just baby, baby 454. We're gonna have to bring her alive. So I got a new battery and I got new internals because these were really worn out. So I got some new ones. We're gonna go back, put it in, turn it on. And I got, I got some news. Well, I got somebody to, uh, I got somebody that I try to contact about some wheels, some rims. They are their own brand. And I wanna check these wheels out because they really look so sexy when it comes to putting it on the C10. So we're gonna check that out. Man, it's just, it's so hot today. I'm trying to get everything done, but. I really like this build. It's pretty fun going all around Houston and Conroe and so many other places that's gonna take me. Just trying to find all these parts and it's just so fun. It really is. We have a ride to exclusive. Ah. I got the battery. I bought some stock internals, Alec. What? I bought some stock internals. I mean, some six internals for the battery because the other ones were terminals. Terminals. You said, you said it's terminals. I'm tired, I need coffee. You know how to put a battery? You ready? Fail, Fail. do it again. Look at the you can't even count. Bloopers, that's me. Uh, I wasn't recording. <laughs> Gallon? We're talking about it does have gas. What you think? 454. Little burnout don't truck. Be, don't be camera shy. <laughs> Little burnout truck. Let's go drive it. I haven't even driven it in a while. You wanna go drive it? Go. You wanna go? I feel like that really don't matter the paint too much. I mean it matters but oh, but I mean a drop truck, old school classic on some badass wheels, badass motors. There's some people that put uh they put gloss on top of the rust. That's all you need. The patina, patina, oh whatever. I'm sweating yeah, we already. Gotta fix those windows, man. Yeah, we, we gotta fix the. No, something else. I think it's the stabilizer. Uh, what's it called? The I don't have uh. What I told you last bar. time? It doesn't have a sway bar. Oh yeah, you need to find out. I guess we're gonna fix it up. Stay tuned. So we can see if she turns on again. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Look at. Hey. Trying to see you smile. Burn out. 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 Burn out
Burn up! A little itty bitty. Ah. With the new wheels, maybe. They're gonna <sighs> pop. Why you don't? Why you don't want to do it? They're gonna pop, man. They're old. They're old. Huh? Well, I tried. So. We're gonna go, I'm gonna go uh, to a rim store. I don't know if it's an actual rim store or uh, just a place where he sells his brand. I really don't know if it's a tire shop. I'm gonna go over there, check out the wheels. Hopefully it's in the price range because I am in a budget when it comes to this build. And I wanna show you guys every little detail, but stacking everything up, buying everything, it really does add up. Bear with me if I go just a little bit. I you were gonna wash it. I was, but I wanna go check the wheels now. Oh, okay. I'll okay. wash it tomorrow. All right, guys, we're gonna go. Go, we're gonna go. All right, see ya. I still have to come up with a name. Guys, let me know what should we call her on the comments. We'll so, see you later, so, bro. So Pull, to the gym. Pull up to the gym. Pull up to the gym? Yeah, it's real good. Damn, so I really I like your watch. Train me, appreciate yeah. it. So, you know, train me, bro. Train me boxing? Yeah. Coming for Freddy. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I made it just time because I was reading the clock from my car. I was not reading the clock from my phone. So technically it's literally 6.20. I thought I had time. I saw the rims in person. They're the only ones that they have literally in stock right now. Somebody was gonna actually pick them up and buy them, but he never came. So I actually got to see what it looked like in person. Trust me when I say they're really, really good, but it's it's a little out of my price range, but I'm gonna see if I can make it work. Right now, I'm in most of the sales throughout the shops around the city. You're the only one that sells this brand? Yeah. These, this brand just came out then, huh? Yeah. Before, and they look really clean, really, yeah. really clean. Very detailed. Yeah. Okay, guys, so there's a problem. The wheels look so clean, so badass. Like I would literally get it in a heartbeat. It's just the thing is that the truck is black and it's, it's chrome with gray. Like the face is gray, right? But the truck is black. Now, those are wheels are the only ones they have in stock, right? They have to wait a month just so they can get new rims. I don't know, like I can get them now, but is it really gonna be worth it having that color on those type of rims going on the truck, black truck? I'm gonna talk to some people and see what they think. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think. We'll see. I think this is it for today. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Turn the bell notification on. Become part of the legacy. And we'll see you on the next vlog. Keep supporting the channel. Keep watching. And I'll keep on trying to push my way to the top. For you guys to see more content of trucks. Some cool badass truck builds in the future. So thanks. See you guys next time.